Okay, it is a hot one out here today in the Doug and Nikki test studio. Not only because we have this amazing product to unbox, play with, and give you a review from one to five, but it's just hot here in Florida. So here's what we're gonna do in this video. I am going to cut to the fun stuff, the action scenes, playing with it. Everybody knows you wanna see that. Then I'm gonna come back. I'm gonna give you the unboxing. We're gonna talk about the features, that kind of stuff. And then I am going to give you the Doug score from one to five and let you know if I think this is crap or it is as good, just so we're on the up and up. This was provided to me to test for you guys with absolutely no rules. I can say it's crap or I could say it's amazing. Whatever actually goes on, it is my own opinion. There are no rules. But what do you say we get in? Let's go play with it. Okay, I'm back from that ridiculous play session. Yes, this is the past and I'm gonna unbox it for the first time and see it myself and talk to you about the features. Let's open it up, see what it looks like. I am so excited with this. As you saw, we have the Doug and Nikki pond in the backyard, which is perfect for this kind of stuff. It was like built for it. It's just like a good size, smooth, a couple alligators, a couple big turtles, but uh, hopefully we didn't run into any of those in the future. First things first, I wanna tell you, it comes with an instruction manual. I do tons of RCs, drones, all that kind of stuff. Each one is a little different, so just read the two paragraphs of how to use it and you will be much happier and have a better experience your first time around. Let's open it up, see what it looks like in here. Oh, it's upside down. Let's go like this. Ooh, I turned it upside down and I found something to talk about on the way. Check out this remote control. This is a 2.4 gigahertz control. It has throttle, reverse or brake. This is for the steering. Uh, there's a speed control, fast or slow. Demonstration mode to do, have it do little stunts for the kids and a trim. That is all right here on this. Um, and on the side here, we have a, your basic on and off and you can control. The boat has four LED lights, which can make it easier to use and look cool. Um, you can opt to turn them on or off to save battery power. Speaking of battery power, this comes with two, count them, two 1200 milliamp batteries, which are good for about 15 minutes each. That means you could take the model, your two batteries, the controller, and go to the lake for 30 minutes of action-packed 20 plus miles an hour boat play. How cool is that? It is self-writing, which is important because um, nobody likes going and swimming for their models or anything like that. So as you can see from the shape, it's basically kind of like circular and it is sealed along the top. Not perfectly sealed, but a basic seal. So if it goes over all the weights here, so it's gonna roll back over and self-write itself, which is awesome. Let's open it up, see what's inside. There you go. The internals are very simple. There's no on off. You just put the battery in here, plug it in there, and then it actually turns on itself when it senses water, which I think is super cool. 
Let's see what comes with the little kit of tools and that kind of stuff. Normally they come with like a little stand, a charger for the batteries. Okay, so here's one of those, I can tell you the truth. This is gonna be one of my nitpicky things I have. I don't understand why we get one 30 cent charger for two batteries. Seems to me they should provide two 30 cent chargers for our two batteries. But I, you know, I try to be honest with you guys, that's my personal opinion. The stand is really cute, it's super easy to put together. Let's throw it together so you can see what that looks like. You know, cause this is a cool looking boat. Like if, you know, if you're a kid or you, you kind of have like a gadget room kind of stuff, this will look nice sitting on the stand. Just put it like that, right like that. Put the top back on it in the meantime while we wait for the batteries to charge. Ta-da! Ooh, and I have another mini complaint actually. No batteries for the RC controller. This is gonna take three double A's. You need your included screwdriver to get into it. Four. Takes four AA batteries. I know normally when these things come, including the battery, they give you the junkiest batteries in the world, but I just like it when you can open it up, throw the batteries in, go play, have a good time. In any case, let's charge it up, and then I'll come back, I'll give you the review. Okay, that was so cool. I've been like chasing alligators around and driving around with the drone video and you've seen the video. This thing works perfectly. It actually, just so you know, it automatically detects the water. There's no on off switch. You just put it in the water and go with the remote control. It is so easy that a wife can use it. Yeah, well, <laughs> She did use it. She was actually, in all that video, Nikki was the boat pilot, not me. I was the drone pilot. Anyway, I hope that was helpful. We'll see you next time.